Zortrax M300 Dual is a large volume 3D printer that can simultaneously print with base and water soluble support filament. In this video, we'll instruct you on how to properly remove the device out of its box and prepare it for first use. You'll also see how to set up the HEPA cover. First, you'll need to open up the box and remove the contents that are placed on the upper cushioning. This includes the side covers, the packing list, the power cable, and the starter kit. After removing the upper cushioning, you'll be able to take out the device. Be careful when you grab the printer, and ideally, you should ask someone for assistance when dealing with heavy lifting. Place the 3D printer on a flat and stable surface and remove the foil. Remove all the shipping clips that secure the rods of the printer. After that, you can remove the belt securing the foams with accessories. In order to safely take out the foams, you'll need to raise the heat bed mount. Once this is done, you can extract all the foam elements from the printing chamber. Now you can lower the heat bed mount to its proper position and take off the safety tapes. Next, you can connect the platform cable to the insider of the printer and later connect the other side of the cable to the build platform. Install the build platform onto the bolts of the heat bed mount. Now you can unpack the filament box and secure it to the back of the printer with two screws. One at the bottom of the box and the other at the top. Next, attach the material guide to the material B end stop. Now it's time to attach the extruder cable clamps at the back of the printer and place the extruder cable in the clamps. Remove the extruder back cover by pulling it upwards and remove the front cover. Plug in the extruder cable and place the front and back covers in their proper place. Next, attach the two material guides to the extruder and to the material end stops. After connecting the guides, make sure you secure them to the extruder cable using material guide clamps. Attach the two spool holders at the back of the printer. Take the spool of support material, cut off the tip of the material for easier insertion, and place the spool on the holder inside the material box. Cover the box once you're done. Now take the spool of model material, cut off the tip and place the spool on the holder. Insert the material to the material end stop. Remember that the spool should rotate anti-clockwise. Feed the materials into the extruder through the material end stops and the material guides. 
You're almost there. Now install the side covers at the sides and at the front of the printer. Later, you can plug in the power cable and turn on the device. You have successfully set up your printer, and there's still time to install the Zortrax HEPA cover on top of your device. You can start by opening the box and removing the guide and protective materials. Remove the box with accessories. The box contains a filter module and a power supply unit. Take out the Zortrax HEPA cover. Remove the bubble wrap. Place the box upside down on a flat surface and use pliers to break off the plastic in the exact same manner as shown in the video. Open up the box with accessories and take out its content. Take out the filter module and attach it to the back of the cover. Use four screws to secure the module to the cover. Put the Zortrax HEPA cover on the printer and make sure the extruder cable fits in the hole at the back of the cover. Take off the safety tape. Finally, you'll need to plug in the power cable to the filter module and adjust the knob. And you've done it! You have successfully unpacked and set up your very own Zortrax M300 Dual 3D Printer.